Thanks a lot. We're following a developing story in southwest Miami-Dade here. A woman has been arrested after police say that she left her young boys alone in the bathtub and her youngest, only seven months old, drowned. Local 10's Leanne went home live now to let us know what that woman was doing at the time. Leanne. Well, police say that this mother left her children alone in this bathtub so that she could get a manicure inside her home. Alyssa Jimmy. 22-year-old Alyssa Jimmy is behind bars facing a charge of aggravated manslaughter of a child after police say her seven-month-old baby drowned in a bathtub. It's been hard the past few days, as you understand. Jimmy's father in the courtroom today vouching for his daughter's character. Alyssa's always been a good daughter. She's always been a great older sibling. She's always loved her children. It all happened last Friday at this home in the Hammocks area of Southwest Miami-Dade. According to Miami-Dade police, Jimmy said she left the baby and his three-year-old brother in the bathtub with the water running and felt comfortable doing so because the drain was missing a plug. Police say she then told them she went to the garage to get an at-home manicure done and when she checked the kids five to ten minutes later, the drain had been clogged with a towel and the baby was unconscious. It's very sad. Set of facts. I'm sorry for your loss. Police say Jimmy ran to a neighbor for help, and that neighbor called 911. The baby was pronounced brain dead at the hospital. Jimmy was since arrested and faced a judge. I'm setting a bond. It's ten thousand dollars, ma'am. So you can bond out of jail. Make sure you stay in touch with your attorney. Listen to what they tell you. In court, it was also revealed that Jimmy is part of the Miccosukee Tribe of Indians. There was an attorney representing the tribe at the hearing today, as well as attorneys representing Jimmy herself. Again, that bond was set at $10,000. Online records show she's posted that bond, but has yet to leave the jail. Reporting live in Southwest Miami-Dade, Leanne Morejon, Local 10 News.